G'day guys, Cyanide here. Back out here in the shed, do a little bit of work on this uh, tanker, I think. I think what I'll do is, um, I'll just do the, this little floor bit in here. Not too much to it. It's a square with a couple of folds in it. And um, I'll, maybe I'll make a start on this area here too with the little piping and things like that. I'll see how I go. Uh, yeah, let's just get on fit today. Okay, so these are the little filler pipes welded on. I drilled some holes and I just put in some little south tappers there. And what I'm going to do is use a bit of chain and these bits of, like, I think they're gas fittings from a uh, LPG heater. So what I'll do is attach them to the end there and put them on like that, like plug ends bit of chain hanging off that'll look pretty good so I'll get back to you soon I won't film this it's a bit fiddly but uh, I'll show you the results in a sec got the little storage tank net um, area all capped off and also got the little hoses there or we connect the hoses I suppose little chains holding on these caps this one here I cut a bit rougher and I also don't have another one of these bits so I'm just going to leave that loose like it's missing because this is, you know, like a wet tanker or a rusty thing. So I think that'll do. A little bit of detailing that you won't even notice really for the most part. But it looks alright. Next up will be um, probably drilling the holes along here for the lights and the extra detailing to go on the back here. Yep. And then weathering so this will I'm not sure if I'll take it to the show and if I do it'll be a work in progress because um, I can't rust the patina process it's just not enough time so yeah but it'll be alright as a work in progress nonetheless okay guys that's all for today's video and I'll catch you on the next one see you later